I'm having a pretty eventful Monday. It's kind of gloomy out here. Oh yeah. So I'll go to work when it's like snowing, when it's raining, and I'm outside all day for like mm, eight to 12 hours, 13, who knows, of standing up and surveying. Yes, uh, out here in the element. It's actually been snowing a lot recently and it's probably mm, freezing nine out of 10 times, but today is a Monday where it's not freezing and I can actually, uh, I can get used to that. Yeah, oh shoot. Happy Monday, everyone. Happy Monday. I hope you're doing good. Hope when you're watching this, you know, you're having a good day. Maybe it's nighttime and you're chilling. I hope you're, I hope you're chilling well. Or if you're about to start your day, start that day. Have a good one. Be productive. Or don't, uh, whatever. Do your thing. <clears throat> but I'll sit down, I'll get the job ready for the day. So again, I'm a land surveyor. I'm gonna start looking at the project uh, for the day ahead and then start kind of plotting it out in my mind. Like, how am I gonna tackle this? And then uh, wait for everyone else to show up. And then we'll roll out, roll out to the job. So that's how that goes. These boots are really beat up and Lil and I do plan to go to Cabela's at some point and get some new ones. Maybe we'll do that tonight and go look at some other stuff. I don't know, but these are my boots. Edwin just gave us our project and we're going to the job. <laughs> you want to do it again? <laughs> R.O.B. you're on TV. <laughs> so guys, this is my partner Rob. We survey together. <laughs> Rob is at the gas station getting some stuff. I am eating my yogurt and granola. Thank you, Lil. I guess you can call this breakfast. It's eight o'clock, see you at the job. Don't be late. You ready to get this bread, Rob? I'm ready. Just go all the way, full send. I would bring 18 steaks and a pipe. And we're off, let's go, Rob. Basically, we gotta get set up on two different points and start putting sticks in the ground to, uh, <laughs> tell our client where his property line is on this huge piece of land. I just got the gun set up. We're gonna start putting in steaks now. We'll go until we run out and then we'll take a lunch. This is my favorite thing in surveying. Set it! Then I guess he yelled that and he puts the he puts the point in the ground. And it's really satisfying because you get to see where the line runs on someone's property. And we're gonna do that another how many times, Rob? Like 16? Yeah. 15, 18 times. <laughs> and that'll be our working day. Yeah, the property we're on right now, it was last surveyed in the 1800s. Um, I don't think George was on this one. Have you ever been on a survey that George Washington previously did? Cause he'll, yes no. he'll put his stamp on stuff. Yeah, yes and no. The guy I used to work for was related to George Washington's boss, whose name was George Hume. And I've done properties that George Hume surveyed, so. So maybe George-, George... Well, he was his helper and worked with him, so most likely. Little George history Washington lesson. Did survey. Little history lesson. Most people don't know that George Washington did surveying, but he did. America, the gun died. Lil's actually on her way right now. Oh shoot, Lil made it. Is this it? Yes. <laughs> Jesus. What is this house? It's being rehabbed, I think. That means like renovated? Yeah. I don't know if I'm in Virginia anymore. It's horse country. I'm gonna go grocery shopping. Okay. Watch the Aldi video, everyone. She goes grocery shopping all the time. Well, thank you for bringing this. Onwards and upwards. Uh, this is the best part. You just get to walk through brush and, and thorns and try not to get hit in the face while carrying a camera. This is pretty tough. This 
We made it to that part of the mountain where I was talking about. Look at that forest. We're gonna try to find a money shot. There's the river and this is the mountain. I would be filming more, but <laughs> surveying is just making a bunch of jokes, standing around and moving from the next thing to the next thing. So you guys, you really aren't missing much. Dude. What happened? The walkie is in the river right now. You see that black spot? <laughs> as soon as I stood up, it just fell out. Oh no. It's starting to rain now guys, but here's your money shot. And uh, was it worth it? Yeah.